expected to have a high of 72 and a low of 55 with partly cloudy skies this morning giving way to clouds and rain this afternoon. Looking ahead, expect a cloudy but mild, milder weekend with possible thunderstorms Sunday morning. Please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for the Link Pride Pledge. I will do my best to be safe, respectful, and responsible to my teachers, myself, and others. I will find the grace to be made by helping others and working together. Commandos de Gildas Labis. I will make the most of every moment in the Halloween school of dreams. Estoy de acuerdo. Our pledge people for today are Vincent, Zima, Julia, Marco. And now here's Tasso with the sports. Chicago Cubs have got their groove back. Chris Bryant, Jason Hayward, and Ben Zobris hit solo homers, and the Cubs beat the San Francisco Giants 5-1 on Thursday for their third straight win. The Cubs and Los Angeles Dodgers, the two best clubs in the National League last season, renew acquaintances this weekend at Dodger Stadium. Cubs ace Jake Arrieta will face Dodgers left-hander Alex Wood tonight in the opener of their three-game set. Also playing tonight are the White Sox. Coming off a three and seven road trip, the White Sox will play host will play host to the Detroit Tigers in a straight doubleheader to open a four-game series. The White Sox will try to snap a three-game skid after being swept by the Arizona Diamondbacks earlier this week in the desert. Chicago returns home for the first time since May 14th. Now back to Victoria with today's announcements. Thank you, Tasso. Another reminder, yearbooks will be handed out, to, out today to all students that purchased one. There is a limited supply for sale in the library by Mrs. Highland's desk. They are $20, first come, first serve. Yearbook signing will take place today, grades 3 through 6, 9 to 9.30, and grades kindergarten through 2nd, 9.30 to 10 o'clock. Monday is W, woohoo day, extra time to spend with family and to honor those who served. Happy Memorial Day. Tuesday is X, excited to cheer on the 6th graders and teachers in a game of kickball. And now Mr. Wilbecker with this week's nominations. Good morning, everybody. Happy Friday. Happy VIP Day. That's actually why we got a late start on our announcements today. We had so many VIPs coming into the building. We had movie stars. We have professional athletes. We even have Elvis. Elvis is in the building today. We took some notes, too. We wanted to see who are the people behind these wonderful celebrities. And the number one answer, who did your hair? Who helped you with your clothes? And it was mom so apparently mom is the key to all celebrities so be nice to your mom that's a little announcement for mr wolbecker all right here's some more announcements from mr wolbecker we've got some students demonstrating great behavior this week like igor carolina shreyas damian and rebecca from mrs gallo's sixth grade math class for the commitment key these students demonst demonstrate their commitment to learning difficult concepts by working together sharing their strategies and asking questions to help guide their reasoning. Mrs. Gallo is very proud of the effort they put forth during the work time in her math class. Nice job. We also have Asha from Mrs. Stacy's classroom, room 212 for the ownership key. When given a deadline, she does an outstanding job 
at consistently turning in assignments way before they are even due. She also does a quality job on everything. Way to go, Asha. We have Kiara from Mrs. Romero's classroom, room 111 for the integrity key. In the morning, her class is given a few different options for morning work. They're able to free write and after they finish two pages in their park book. Kiara only completed one and was honest with himself that he needed to complete one more page before working on his writing. Good job. Another sixth grader, it's Sammy from Mrs. Teed's classroom, room 203 for the key of commitment and for showing kindness. Mrs. Teed's classroom is currently making a poster for their upcoming career fair and Mrs. Teed thought it was so sweet of Sammy and her family to bring in extra posters for students who might not have any. Oh, I love hearing that. Students, if I just called your name, come on down just a moment after announcements, but let's recognize some staff members like Mr. Cropper for doing an outstanding job coordinating a perfect field day. I hope you all had fun yesterday. Thanks, Mr. Cropper. How about Miss Ratcliffe for the commitment key? She was nominated by Mrs. Romero. She is constantly committed to helping both staff and students. She has also shown a lot of flexibility with her schedule and being ready to go whenever someone may need her to lend a hand. How about Mrs. Vander Heiden in fifth grade for the commitment key? She was nominated by Mrs. Stacy. She put in a lot of extra work to create a rigorous shared reading test and edit a social studies test. She always stays student-centered and teaches from the heart. Mrs. Vander Heiden truly cares about her students and what they are learning. Nice job, staff. Everyone, we've got a lot of fun things going on today. Make sure you're safe, respectful, and responsible throughout all those fun things. And of course, keep on rocking. Thank you, Mr. Thank you for tuning in to the WLNK Studio for your morning news. Have a VIP Friday and enjoy the long weekend. <laughs>